A Christmas display in Fremont honoring a man who relatives are calling the King of Christmas. Angeline McCall spoke with his family about how they're hoping it helps others who may be having a hard time this Christmas season. Angeline? Skis, another elf. It's easy to see just a Christmas display here. This is what we call, or what I call, the spirit of Christmas past. Each piece holds a memory. Christmas past, my father. The spirit is my father, my parents. My father passed away five years ago. Terry Balder's father hated Christmas when she was little. She called him a Scrooge. No, he didn't get a lot during Christmas. That's, I think, a lot of why he has such a sour taste in his mouth. He had a heart attack one day. It changed him. And he became, we call him the Christmas King. He wanted to give back to the community in a way that he could do it and personalize it himself. And that would be by building his Christmas displays. He began building each of these pieces. Every inch of it, glued, painted, sawn, cut, everything by hand. The train, though, is Terry's favorite. I will always remember the train is because of the smile on the train. And he actually took wood and made the eyes, the nose, and actually carved the smile out of, of a piece of wood. It's always going to be Dad's smile to me. Since her father had a stroke about 25 years ago, these decorations never came out. This year, two months after Terry's mom died, it felt right to put up the display once again at the same house in Fremont where her parents lived. This is my way of grieving. And this, this is it. This is, I think this is my calling now to take over after my father. Terry hopes people who stop to see the display will donate funds for True North Community Services in Fremont. One of the greatest things that we can give another person is hope. Mike Voigt with True North says already 2,000 kids in Nuego County will be getting Christmas toys because of people like Terry. It provides them the hope um, that things can get better and that somebody cares about them. A light display bringing the king of Christmas back to life and spreading his joy along the way. It's the spirit of Christmas. Um, my mom and dad don't have to be here to share the spirit of Christmas. It's just seeing everybody out here stopping by. Santa will be at that display Friday through Monday from 6 to 8 p.m. They'll also be handing out cookies and candies and other goods. There will also be a donation kettle set up for anyone who wants to donate to True North. Live in the studio, Angela McCall, Fox 17 News. Wow, what an amazing display. Yeah, pretty impressive indeed. Angeline, yeah. thank you.